So today I have arrived here at Lark Cottage uh, on the edge of the Broads National Park and it's a house of two halves. Let's go and have a look. So from the outside it really does look like quite a traditional home but I really want to explain to you how it is a house of two halves. So the sitting room um, flooded with so much natural light from those big windows going out to the front. Great size, you've got even three massive sofas in here. Lovely feature fireplace there. But let's go and have a look at the kitchen. So when it comes to kitchens, obviously they're a big part of the home and the owners really did think very carefully when they designed this house to create a wonderful family kitchen area. Loads of worktops, really nice use of granite on there. And I just love the way it flows right into that family room with sofas and the double doors that take you out onto the, uh, the terrace out at the back. So we're just coming through the brilliant size utility room, superb downstairs loo. And this is where it gets interesting, this is the two halves. So the current owners have got this set up as a really nice self-contained annex. And I have to say, you know, when it comes to annexes, this is pretty good. Loads of sitting space here, loads of light again, brilliant kitchen, but it keeps giving. So we're just passing its own private front door, or side door effectively, into the sitting room, which again is a lovely size. French doors leading out onto the garden there. I'd be quite happy to live in this annex. So I've just come up the staircase from the annex. Uh, so it's private landing up here. We've got two bedrooms, both on the suite. Uh, this master bedroom, I have to say though, brilliant size. And we've even got a little Juliet balcony here that overlooks that lovely garden. So this is where it kind of splits. So this door connects the main house to the annex, but equally, as one house, it works really well. Got a principal bedroom through here, which again is a lovely size, Juliet balcony, got an ensuite over there. And then we've got two further bedrooms and a brilliant family bathroom. But I'm pretty blown away by the size of this landing. So obviously coming outside, we've got two brilliant terraces here, perfect for entertaining. One thing I really love about this house is the gardens are beautiful. They've taken real pride in the planting. Uh, I mean, the lawn is immaculate. And one space I really do love in this garden is this gazebo. I could just imagine long evenings sat here, having dinner, chatting with friends as well. So the village of Upton is, is really well located just off the A47. Five minute walk to the Stave, which leads on to the river, and there's a great pub down there and a local shop. But the Broads National Park goes for miles, interconnecting the river ways uh, and onto those beautiful broads. But don't forget, we're not that far from the coast as well. Mm -hmm. 